don't think I've shown the cottage in the daylight um, yet. So I'll just give you a little pan around now because it's quite nice. So this is the front door and there's the little porch out there. Got some nice flower pots. They're growing some tulips. It's the living room. I mean the view is just great. And I really like these paintings. Show them all. I love these parrots as well. I think they're really cool. I love sort of abstract art. I also really like these cushions on these chairs. They are great. Great cushions. And the rugs as well. They're really good. Some good decor going on here. Good cottagey uh, boho decor. So I thought I'd show you these prints that I got in the daylight as well. So there's this one, which I love, and he is really jealous of this one, he wishes that he got it. It doesn't actually say the artist's name on it, but it's got the signature there, it just says Gleg. I'm pretty sure these are available online though, um, I think they're a bit more expensive than what I paid in the shop. Um, but I'll link it below if I can, and f see if I can find the artist's name as well. And then there's this one, which is a little bit bigger. I really like the sort of graphic style. I think it really suits the mountains because they do actually look like that. They are like black mountains, which I really like. They're my favorite mountains here. Peter McDermott. Yeah, Lee says that he doesn't like this one so much because he doesn't like this font and he doesn't like that it's over the picture. But I like that. Yeah, these were both 7.99 each, so they were pretty cheap. to Portree this morning um, and had some brunch at the Aros Experience Visitor Centre. Um, we wanted to see the St Kilda exhibition but it was closed um, and then we went back to the gift shop that we went to yesterday because Lee wanted to pick up a few things. That was kind of the main reason that we went back up to Portree um, and we were going to go to the visitor centre at the Talisker Distillery as well, but we kind of forgot on the way back. I got some Isle of Skye chocolate, and I just noticed that it's Anglesey Sea Salt. That's funny. Um, and then this postcard, which is really nice. So that's by Marcus McAdam, if you wanted to look him up. And then he got this print. And it's from the same collection as uh, my one. Lee wanted to do a bit of a walk up Blabine, which I know that's not how you pronounce it, but it sounds a lot more fun than Blavan, which I think is how it's supposed to be pronounced. But anyway, it's a mountain that's right next to our cottage. So Lee's just gone to do a bit of a walk for that. I'm going to pick him up in a couple of hours. Hopefully there'll still be a bit of daylight then to do my lookbook, um, sort of at sunset. So I'm just going to edit a video now. The first lookbook that we filmed a couple of days ago, I think I'm going to edit that one and put that up for Monday. So I'll leave it linked below. It's a Parker lookbook. Four different outfits with a Parker, basically. It'll just be a quick, short little lookbook. Yeah, so this is our last day on Sky. I'm very sad about it. I've come to very, very much like this island. So yeah, tomorrow after we leave here, we're actually heading to New Lanark, which is just south of Glasgow. Five or six hour drive from there. So we'll just pop on an audio book. We're listening to Brian Cranston at the moment. I'm really enjoying it. We listen to it on the way up. Yeah, he's a cool guy. Would recommend. So yeah, I think that's about all I can 
ramble about now. I better get on with editing this video. So I really hope that you enjoyed seeing the Isle of Skye and some of Scotland this week with me. Please give the video a thumbs up if you did enjoy it and leave me a comment and subscribe if you want to. afternoon I think it's one o'clock now um, we're in Glencoe we've done the drive from Skye we just stopped at Fort William to pick up some lunch I've got egg mayo or egg and cress uh, baguette just popped into the Glencoe visitor centre as well because I didn't look in the gift shop on our way through last week uh, I picked up this little Christmas decoration I think he's so adorable he's a little Scotty dog I was obsessed with Scotty dogs when I was a kid. So yeah, I'm gonna eat now. So today it is as cold as it was last winter, it's currently zero degrees and there's snow everywhere and I love it but also it is very chilly outside. Bunch of geese in the car park, oh and there was cars blocking my view. We just stopped at the services to have some lunch, really, um, even though it's a bit late for lunch. Um, we stopped at this services before, I think it's Annandale, and there's geese, um, just just chilling around. Um, it was in the summer that we stopped here, so we thought they would, wouldn't be here. Um, just hanging out in the car park looking for crumbs. Yeah, it's about half past three or something, isn't it? Um, something like that. And we're just having lunch now because I've got a salad. And what do you have? Sandwich? A wrap. A chicken wrap. A wrap. Uh, there he is! There he is! No. That's not going in. <laughs> yeah. Don't, I just want to show the geese, really. 